morning guys. I know this is weird. I am headed to the gym right now. Um, it's been a minute, so I'm trying to get used to this because this is actually my first vlog on my new camera. I will speak about that later. But I'm headed to the gym. Hope you guys stay as going well. So this is my gym. It's in the basement of my center, my apartment complex. I normally sing, stand here, sing and dance for a couple of hours. I'm normally here earlier, like six, before work. But yeah. Um, so first thing I normally do is jog a little bit on the treadmill. And then I come and do weights a little bit, depending upon how I feel. I should. So, yeah. I like the mirror. It's really nice. But yeah. Chemistry, but um, just going and kind of finishing things up. It feels so weird being here now. <sighs> kind of out of shape, too. <laughs> so, I'll talk to you guys a little later. I'll probably still show you the EDC in the library later. I know that there is like a big elephant in the room um, as far as the channel and everything like that, um, the channel name and all of that, but. Um, I just thought I would come in and di like directly talk to you guys about this. Like, um, Swift, well, Hillary will no longer be a part of the channel. Um, I wanna just say creative differences. You know, with things like that, sometimes you just kinda gotta let it go. You know, you, like, sometimes with things, you just have to let them go. With friendships, relationships, um, clothes <laughs> every situation you just kind of have to let it go so i mean that's just the point that i'm at um it's not it wasn't a big argument over the channel or anything like that that caused it to turn out this way i just think that it's different paths and different things like that so um so yeah that addresses that it of course you're gonna see it of course you're gonna notice it like especially if you've been following me for like the past months or so it's big it's not anything small so i'm not trying to hide it it is what it is that's just how i feel about it but yeah i'm gonna get back into today's vlog um right now i'm actually headed back home today's going pretty well it's really it's not too hot like i thought it was gonna be a lot hotter i thought it was gonna be hot with my outfit but it's going pretty well yeah but yeah, I did pick up some things and I do want to film a um, Forever 21 Plus and a Rue 21 Plus size haul 
because I did pick up a few things from both of those stores and I do kind of want to go ahead my arm is hurting that's so why I'm switching back and forth and I might just do it in the vlog I haven't decided yet how I want to do it because um, I haven't filmed a haul in a while so I don't know we'll see but I might just film it in this vlog I think that's probably what I'll do but yeah other than that things are going pretty well um, I was thinking about trying to get a mount or sitting you guys right there but I'm just so scared I'm gonna drop this freaking camera I have to get used to this I'm so used to vlogging on my iPhone that I'm kind of like not lost for words but kind of like trying to figure out where to hold it and like I don't know I like it I love the upgrade because I know last time I did talk my last video I did talk about my upgrade and the focus on the quality of our channel um I want to take this break to get together maybe an intro and an outro and maybe music and little things that people take for granted for their channel I want to make sure that my channel is up to par I also want to get up to par as far as my equipment that I'm using I want to make sure that for the, for the people that watch that it's an enjoyable experience what I was planning on doing and what I wanted and where I saw the channel and things like that so I can honestly say I never expected it to be like this but that's how I feel about my life right now at this point I never expected it to be like this but I feel okay with way that it's going and I feel that way with the channel as well like I never expected it to be like this I never expected things to happen like this but I mean you live and you learn and I was speaking with one of my mom's best friends um, a couple of minutes ago and she was just telling me and praying praying over me and telling me like it it's a reason for everything and you may not know it yet but God has it in plan and one day you will look back on the situation and you'll be like oh wow that's why that happened so that this could happen you know it's not you can't look at it as an ending just yet because you don't really know if it's an ending but you just have to live in the moment and I've learned that like with my mom being sick um, moments are short <laughs> they are so short and when you're in the moment you think oh my goodness like oh this is crap it's like really bad but like honestly I never thought I'd say four years ago that I would be able to go through everything I've been through and still be alive I always would think like because you know my mom my mom wasn't young she was 55 I would always think what am I gonna do without my mom I don't know what I'm gonna do without her like I don't think I'll be able to survive when she does pass at some point and here I am I'm surviving I'm on my own like I'm making decisions for myself that people my age don't do like I'll have to do another updates video and kind of talk about like some of the decisions that I'm kind of deciding but like if anyone else out there I guess I'm speaking to the person that was myself I would say a year ago like you're gonna be okay like you may feel like this is it and there is no better you can't go you may be at the lowest point in your life but that point is when God will pick you up and show you that that is like that will be the lowest point and that you will go up and you will be okay and you will be better and that's how I feel I'm just taking everything day by day stride by stride and see where we go but I'm gonna go ahead and end this clip because this is already a long ass clip so, <laughs> so I'm just gonna go ahead and end it um, and I'll see you guys later all right so you guys I think I'm gonna do like a slight haul for my forever 21 and re 21 i know i said it in the car but i think i'm gonna do it and then i just thought about it. i completely forgot to um show you guys the library in the ec um it's like the student union at my school sorry if i'm looking at a viewfinder i'm still getting used to this <laughs> just charge it to my brain being a little everywhere but um yeah i'm gonna show you guys the pieces that i got i'm not sure if i'm gonna do a try on portion of it just because that's a lot of work um I guess I could I, mean, I can you know well the first thing I have it on now this shirt I got it it was five dollars Rue 21 everything I got from Rue 21 was five dollars it was for every 21 where I 
spent money that I probably shouldn't have. But anyways, everything I got from Rue 21 was $5, so I don't feel bad about that. But um, yeah, give me a second to get myself together, and then I'll come back in the next clip. If you guys could only see this setup, like, literally, if y'all fell down. <laughs> but um, I just wanted to... Y'all on the coffee table on top of the candle, but I know it's kind of silly, but yeah. Okay, so the first thing I got was this, um, everything I got was $5, I think I already said that, but um, this like swing dress, can you see? It's like really, like those, I call it a swing dress, I don't know the actual name of it, but it's like a like flowy type of dress it's not fitted anywhere at all maybe the arms i guess but it's like a swing type of dress and i look like flustered it's because i don't have on no makeup i don't even like i haven't even done my hair so if i look horrible please just excuse me just know that one day i will get it together <laughs> i will get it together but yeah this dress and i got it i like the pleat in the back well it's not even a pleat it's like a you can see it. it's like a sewn down the bottom in the back that gives it like a little kind of flare to it i got it in a 1x yeah 1x um yeah i think it's really cute and the material's really really soft so it's not like like rough it's very springy is what i'm trying to say it's not it looks like it'll be a winter type of dress but it's very springy because the material is very light and it's long it goes to my knees almost um yeah i really like this this was five dollars but I've said that like four times now. Um, the next thing I got was this shirt. I have a shirt similar to this one. I didn't get it from Rue 21 and it's not long sleeved. And I like the pockety type shirts. It's kind of like this shirt in a different color. Um, I really like the like openness of it. Like I like V-necks in general. And I like that it's like kind of it's not like a tight v-neck like you know some v-necks can be tight it's kind of like open like this one is like loose and like flowy let the air grow through it's not like sick sucking you in or anything i got this in a 2x because i wanted it to be kind of big so i could wear it with leggings and wear it as like an outfit and not have to wear it as a shirt all the time um with jeans but i thought it was really cute and i like the color of it i think the color looks really good on my skin sometimes you know dark skinned people the darker the color sometimes you can look washed out and like makes you look kind of washed out and my hair being blue back blue my hair being blue black doesn't help with that so i have to be kind of mindful of that sometimes um the next thing that i got were these pants they're like they're joggers they're not like joggers they are joggers and um yeah they have the little i like the cinching at the bottom with a thing that goes around your leg like that i have another pair of these from walmart in gray and black um but i like that part at the bottom and i wanted this color because i was thinking i could wear it with a black shirt um i could wear it with this black shirt i could wear it with the tank top or like um, but that's that in this shirt that's everything i got from Rue 21 plus um and then the next two items i am so in love with i'm going to talk about them together um because if i do try them on i'm going to try them on together just because i bought them so they could be together but um this is from forever 21 plus not the actual side not the skinny side of the store but the plus size side of the store i got these shorts oh my goodness they are life my goodness i love them and i got them in a size 16 um just because they are kind of fitted let's see um and then what else i got was this shirt um it's kind of a distressed tee oh it's inside out no wonder yeah i was like where's the print on it it's a printed tee but it's kind of distressed like the bleach you know the the, the bleach distress look kind of rocker tee i got this and a 2x i was with my friend bria um and she was telling me that i probably should get a 1x but i tried on the 1x and it's it's so hard being tall and larger because 
a majority of the time the way clothes are made they're made for big for larger people who are shorter so some things just don't fit properly with me and so I have to size up sometimes or size down just to get it to look like it's supposed to look so for this I got a 2x and um I'll actually show you guys what I mean by the whole not fitting right because it's kind of short um and for a tall person my extremities are long <laughs> My legs and hands are my legs and arms are long so it's kind of like it looks silly the one X looks silly I'm just gonna say that it's just straight out it looks silly so what I thought I would do is I would get the two X and kind of wear it a little larger and then if I lose weight it'll kind of be a little baggy which is fine with me I'd rather have baggy than tight any day but yeah that was just my little short clothing haul I wanted to put in the middle of the video I will see you guys later on today. I do have quite a lot of stuff that I have to do later on. So, see you guys later. Alright, so I'm going to go pick up one of my close friends. One of my close friends. But no, I was talking to her the other day. And I've known her a really long time. And so, I asked her, did my driving scare her? Because I do drive a little bit crazy a lot. And her reply was, you've had my life in your hands for almost 10 years. I was like, wow, it's been a long time. That is true though. It has always been 10 years. And that just like made me think about like my whole life. Like, you know, sometimes you get friends and they're like family. So, yep. Just wanted to come on and say that before I go and pick her up. to the mall so I'm gonna pick her up from her and we're going to the mall. I didn't tell you guys but this hair is La Fair. Um you know the review that I did well I don't know if you know or not on my channel I did a La Fair review a couple of months back almost a year ago probably a year ago um and this is La Fair hair and I dyed it um blue black with the adore dye that everyone's raving about um yeah i really like it i have to do a sit down review with that um soon Ooh, you fell over <laughs> you fell down that wasn't good was it <laughs> hope you didn't take too hard of a hit <laughs> Okay, let's try not to fall over again. I'm just gonna pull right here. I see her, she's over there on the phone. I don't wanna have to call her cause she's not paying attention. Let me call her and see. shades on because it is sunny. Hey. Hey girl. My car oh. is a mess. Excuse the mess. How are you I was talking to Ari Ariana today. I hope you vlogging me. Yeah. Hi anyway. YouTube. But anyway. Trailer. I guess Never that's cute. I 
have a pair like that. Is it itchy? This is my outfit of the day. I think I showed y'all earlier though. No, thank you. This is cute. She little though. They, you know they don't ever have our size and nothing cute like that. <laughs> you have to really shop to try and find something. Where's it now? It don't matter. These people give you the look and you finally realize what the look <laughs> what the look is. You be like, up oh, there that look that everybody be talking about they get when they vlog in. <laughs> I mean, they gonna look one way or another, you know? Yeah. That's <laughs> true. Do you wanna have the plus section? This one down. Nothing in Greensboro got the plus section. The Charlotte Roost do, but that was like that little, <laughs> little two it's racks. Beefy. Two racks. <laughs> it's big, big, A plus size person can't even get in there. It's okay. <laughs> But she is telling the truth though. I guess we'll go downstairs. Back by Bath and Body Works with their good ass sale that they're having today. I'm, gonna go back in there. I'm not going back, but they got me good this time. <laughs> when you don't know what to say. So I just got back from Bria's house. Um, yeah, I didn't really vlog that much there because I didn't really, I, don't know, I just didn't think about it. But I'm about to head to bed. Thanks for watching, guys. Make sure I'm out of focus. Make sure you like, subscribe. Let me know how you like the vlog. I know it's kind of different for me. I don't really vlog that much. But um, let me know how you liked it. Give me a thumbs up. Bye.